in the gray stuff. Check it out, coming up. Hi there Tackler, welcome back to Leah Tackles where I share my love for all things Disney with you. In this video, we are going to be making something that I am really excited about. I have been wanting to make the gray stuff or a copycat recipe for the gray stuff from Beauty and the Beast, the famed line try the gray stuff, it's delicious. Don't believe me? Ask the dishes. And we're gonna make it today. So excited, I've been wanting to make it. I have a Dole Whip recipe, which I will link up there on the eye, and I will link down in the description box as well. But I'm so excited to make this. But before we get started, just super quick, if you are new to my channel, hi there, my name is Leah. I upload Disney videos on this channel every week. So if you guys like seeing recipes like this one, DIY videos, pin hauls, tutorials, unboxings, subscription boxes, things like that, then definitely consider subscribing. And let's go ahead and get started. All right, I will have all the measurements below, but you will need Oreos, cake mix, vanilla pudding, whipping cream, and you are going to need a piping bag and tip, baking cups, and edible pearls for the top. First, you are going to make your devil's food cake mix to the package instructions. So just like it says on the box. So all your normal stuff, your oil, your water, your eggs. Mix it all up. You can mix it by hand. Doesn't take very long, just typical cake mix stuff. So mix it all up. And what's really nice about this recipe is it can come together pretty quickly. Then you are going to use muffin tin liners, keeps it clean and the silver looks really pretty for the gray stuff. You will put those in. I always use a quarter cup measure to get just the right amount in. And these ones are easier if you do not overfill the cups. It's easier to get the gray stuff on the top. You will put them into the oven and again, bake them to the package instructions. Then you are going to make your vanilla pudding. This is not instant vanilla pudding, it is the cook and serve type. So that is what I'm doing right there. Again, just to your package instructions with that. And then you are going to pulse all of your Oreos in a food processor. You could also use a rolling pin if you needed to do so until it is very, very fine, like I'm showing here. Then you are going to make your homemade whipping cream. And you can also use a little bit of confectioner's sugar to stabilize that cream. Homemade whipping cream is so delicious. It's so yummy. You are going to mix the vanilla pudding. Mine, you can see, got a little burnt in the pan, but that's okay. And then your Oreos and the whipping cream all together until it looks gray because it is the gray stuff and it is so so yummy don't over mix because you don't want to lose that gray color and then you are going to pipe it on which i had a little bit of trouble with a few of these um, i think i needed a little bit more of the sugar to stabilize but they ended up tasting amazing i hope you guys really enjoy it let me know if you try it out for sure if you guys make this, definitely let me know in the comments. I cannot wait to hear about. Let me know. Is it delicious? Let's hope so, right? Let's hope it's really, really good. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you like it. Share it with a friend who might like it, who loves the gray stuff and needs to try it. Go ahead and click right there to see my latest Disney video and click right there to see other Disney videos from me. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have a magical day. See you real soon. Bye.